Okay, we're gonna lay out a simple concrete block pilaster uh, for whenever you're doing block walls for added strength. So it's this is real easy, real cake. You can use any block, any size you want. It's all the same principle, just the different sizes. Right now, what I'm using is I'm using tens because I have a bunch of tens. So I'll show you with that. So what I'll do. I'll take an 8-inch jam or sash block, and I will stick it right in the between the run of, of, of uh, two block, okay? Then I'll take, where did that one, okay. Then I'll take a 12-inch 12 12 jam or slash or sash, and I'll stick it right there on top of on top of the eight and you can see I'm now I'm locked in to uh, to the wall and I'll take a six inch now and stick it in front of that this will go in front of here alrighty and then I'll take another another 10 and I'll put it like so and take the other 10 over here put it like so yeah pilasters are you kind of need them because concrete block walls are not a lot of not a lot of lateral strength in them you know when you backfill they like to fall over and a corner is the strongest part of a concrete block wall so we're sort of mimicking one all right now I'll take another eight that was a 12 I used here we'll put another eight right there And then another 10 in front. And where's my other 10? And here's my other 10. So you kind of get a gist of it. And then when you do this, make sure you got some rebar going down in it. Grout up the cores, you know, fill up the cores, make them make it strong. So, anyways, that's a simple way to do it without using clips or anything like that, and it'll work. And, and as I said, you could, if you did eights, you can do an eight-inch eight inch block wall and then use, still use an eight-inch sash, and then you, you could either use a 10 or a 12 sash, and then either a four-inch solid or, or a four-inch block or you can use 12 inch block you you get the you get the idea but it makes a good strong it, wall it, it it helps with the strength and, and uh, it's a lot stronger than the clips yeah it's it's a little bit but anyways it'll it'll help with the strength on a on a concrete block wall you should maybe put these Depending on how things are engineered, if you got an engineer to tell you what the loads are, you know, you usually stick these things 10 or 12 foot, you know, depending on how far you got a backfill or whatever, but that's up to you to find that. But that's how you do it. It's just make sure you have enough footer to stick the pilaster on. And you can stick them on the inside of the structure or on the outside. I, I think on the inside they're a little stronger, but... Uh, that's just my opinion. And don't so, go skimpy on your footers. Yeah, nice big, nice big footer. <laughs> so that's how you do it. It's, it's pretty cake. All right, see ya.